I'm on my own, broken and alone. I feel the rain crashing down. Hey guys, um, long time no talk. <laughs> um, I have not filmed in, well, I've actually filmed like a little bit here and there, but nothing like enough to make like a full video out of it. So I actually never did anything with it. <laughs> I'm going on a graduation trip with my family. Um, it's a four day long trip and so I have to pack for that and so I thought I would bring you guys along to pack with me. Um, I've never done a video like this and I actually really really enjoy watching them so I thought that I could do one and see how it goes. I leave tomorrow morning very very early so I really need to start packing because it is already 2.14 this evening so let's get packing. Okay, so this is the suitcase I will be using. I got it um, a few years ago. It has served me really, really well. And it's been really sturdy for me. I've used it on almost every single trip I've been on. Okay, so I'm going to open up these packing cubes and um, lay out everything that I'm thinking about taking. Here we go, here we go again. Trying hard, but you want to be my friend. Ain't no place to hide, ain't no one to run to. Here we go, here we go again. Call my bluff, I'm going to be here till the end. I'm the one you ride, I'm the one you ride to. If you don't... Hey guys, okay, so I'm done packing for tonight. I went ahead and packed um, the rest of everything that I'm going to pack tonight. And I want to show you guys... So, this is it. This, I have my jeans, shirts, bathing suit, or swimsuit, um, pants, all of that good, all of my clothes right here. And then, in this zippered part, I have all of my, like, undergarment stuff in these two bags. All of my shoes right here, except for the shoes I'm going to be wearing tomorrow. And then in this bag, I have all of my makeup. So I have brushes in this little pocket right here. I have some face masks behind this pocket in this zippered part that I need to zip up quickly. And then here I have all of my makeup, makeup remover wipes, um moisturizer serum is buried in here amazing stuff right here had to take that um yes that is it for this bag in this bag i have this little bag that hangs up the very last bag i have is my like electronics bag with all of my chargers uh portable chargers extra phone cases all that good stuff and that won't get packed until in the morning I'm going to get off here for tonight. I'm going to shower, relax, go to bed, like I said, very, very early morning. Um, so, yes, um, I will see you guys hopefully in the morning. Hey, guys. So, um, uh, I've been awake for a little bit, but it kind of looks like I just woke up. My hair is still a mess. I'm about to get ready and go to work. But I wanted to hop on here and kind of explain a little bit because I, in this video, I packed for my trip. I showed like a tiny bit of driving and then I'm going to go straight into when I get home and showing what all I got in Branson. So it was a very long video because I actually got a lot of stuff from Branson. So I wanted to just shorten it, take this part out because there was a few little clips in between, but not really enough to vlog me being there. So I just wanted to do packing and a haul for you guys. So yes, I just wanted to kind of clarify and explain a little bit better. So yes, enjoy the haul part of the video. So I'm gonna show you TJ Maxx stuff first. So I did wear this on the trip. So it is very wrinkly. Um, But the first thing I got was this shirt. And I believe it was $19.99, but it was actually so cute, so I wanted to get it. And it just has, like, the star constellation on it, I believe is the correct term for it. Don't come at me if I'm wrong. The next thing I got was this shirt, and I did not wear this while we were there. I believe I got this shirt for $9.99. So, yes, 
I really like this shirt. I was really excited to find this shirt. Next, I got the Laneige water sleeping mask. So I used it the night, the first night I had it when we were in the hotel. And I wanted to get it for a really long time, but I just could not justify spending that much money. But now that I've gotten it, I will definitely rebuy it when it's gone because I really, really do love this product. And the next thing I got from Target was this Vanity Planet Ice Roller. Very happy I got it. This was $12.99 for sure. The very last thing I got from Target is this Jessica Simpson yoga mat. I got some good things for my boyfriend. Um, I got something for my mom. So um, I really, really love the shops in Branson Landing. If you have not ever been to Branson, it's an amazing place to go. They have so many things to do and it's just such a fun, family-friendly place. So let's start off with... This is my mom's, um, but I'm gonna show you what I got her because, or what she got because it's actually really cute. Um, the first place we went was Paula Deen's and um, this is a, like a butter cutter thing. I really don't watch her that much, but you know, her, her one of her trademarks is butter, or not trademarks, but you know what I'm talking about. Um, and then mom collects salt and pepper shakers. So <laughs> she got these butter y'all salt and pepper shakers which i think are literally one of the cutest things ever like you cannot tell me that is not the absolute cutest thing you've ever seen in your life so i was very happy that she found those two things because i know that she was very happy about it so yes okay the next thing i got or the first the, whatever next thing i'm going to show you is this candle and this also came from Paula Deen's and I thought it was literally the cutest thing ever. The next place I went was GNC and as you can tell the bag's about to break. Um, I have, I, I did not eat the healthiest on this trip. That's 100% a fact. Um, but I have actually been eating a little bit healthier than usual, which is great. Um, so, I really like um, Alani News Protein Shakes. Um, I tried this one, and it's an amazing breakfast for me. It fills me up like crazy. Um, so, I went ahead and got one of these bad boys, and then I got um, a few different flavors of them. I got chocolate, I got vanilla, and the last one I got is... fruity cereal um so i'm excited to try those um and then i also got one of the alani new fit snacks and this one is the blueberry muffin i actually have not tried any of these so i'm excited to try this and then i got a liquid IV package. I've heard a lot of really good things about them and they were selling them just in single packets and I thought why not try it while well, I can get it in a single. And then um, I got a Quest peanut butter cup. I wanted again to get it while I could get it in a small package. I've seen a lot of boxes of them. Sorry I keep looking up. Ugh. Um, anyways. Um, I have seen like the bigger boxes of them and I wanted to try them without buying a big box of them just in case I did not like them. And then as he was ringing them up, he told me that they gave me this one for free. So we're doing great. Again, saw big packages of these, wanted to try them without buying a whole big package. Um, but I felt of it. It's actually really soft. So I'm really excited to try this. The next place I went was Maurice's. If I'm saying that correctly, I believe I am, but I always feel like I'm gonna butcher a name here or there. Um, but I got a few, or a couple different shirts there. I got this, which is actually, it's wrinkled of course, but it's very, 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 very cute. And I really like it and I was really happy to find it. Um, and I got a really good deal on everything too. Um, Next, I got this shirt, and it is actually strapless, which is really crazy for me. I don't normally wear strapless shirts, but this shirt is literally so cute. The last thing I did get from Maurice's is this perfume. If you can see it, it is super duper duper bright. So, we did go to Walmart, I believe whenever we went to TJ Maxx. 
And I found this really, really cute Branson shirt. Um, I got a few different things from my boyfriend. Um, and so one of these things I just happened to see while I was at Walmart and I thought it'd be so cute, but it says our date night fun. Hopefully I'm going to see him tonight. So hopefully I'm going to be able to give him this stuff tonight. If not, um, I obviously won't upload this video until he sees this because I want it to all be a surprise, but this is the very first thing I got him. I'm going to set everything for my boyfriend up here so that I can possibly wrap it and give it to him tonight. The very next place I went was this store in Versona, Versana. I don't want to butcher the name, but it is a super duper cute store and I will definitely go back there whenever I visit Branson again and I'm sure there will be a second time because I absolutely love to go to Branson. Um, but I got my mom this bag. It just has, does it have a pocket? Yes, it has a pocket on this side um, and it buttons on top and it's got a little pocket on the inside. The next place I went was this store called French Tesco's and all I'm going to say is I absolutely love Francesca's. The first time I went to a Francesca's was this one in Branson, y'all. It has a place in my heart. Like, I literally love Francesca's, so I was so happy to go there. Um, I got a couple anklets. This was the first. And then this is the other one. I think that they're so cute. Um, and then... I was very excited to find this because I really like to have blue light glasses. Um, I'm on my phone a lot. I'm on the computer a lot. Blue light glasses are definitely a must. Um, they're obviously very reflective, so it's not very good. They're very orange with this light. Um, they're not this orange in person. It came in this little box, which is absolutely super cute. The very next thing I got was this little box and it says my prayers in it. <laughs> These little cards in here that are cute and it says today is my prayer and it has little um, leave things on the bottom that matches the lid of the box. And I just think this is so adorable and I thought it would be really, really cute for my dorm room. So the last two things I got from Versona were these two anklets, um, which I think are so cute. One has shells on them. And one is like another gold anklet. So I think that these are so, 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 so cute. Um, I was excited to again find these because sometimes it is actually really, really hard to find anklets. So yes, that's that. The next place I went was Victoria's Secret. Is it a real haul if you do not have Victoria's Secret? Um, I love Victoria's Secret. Um, they usually are running some really good deals. Um, so I have this. I got this Delicates bag because I feel like you can really never have too many Delicates bag. I really need a new one. Mine was really too small. So yes, I got that. Um, and then they were running a $4 for $40 sale on this particular line. One, well, this line, whatever. I don't know. This scent was included in this sale. So I got the coconut milk and rose exfoliating body scrub and this all of this stuff is coconut and what is it? Coconut milk and rose. So I got the 24 hour moisture body lotion and it smells so good. Um, I got the uh, body wash and I got the perfume or the fragrance mist. So super duper cute, super duper smells good um and then the last thing i got from victoria's secret was versus him platinum and this is a cologne for my boyfriend um i was so excited about this find because it literally smells so good and i think he will absolutely love it i'm so excited to give this one to him for sure the next place i went was Bass Pro Shop and again is it really a trip to Branson Landing if you did not go by Bass Pro so I got him a couple different things um I got which 
he called me. I went in there the first time, and these were the two things I got. So this is kind of funny. Um, but I got these Guggen Squad Bandito Bugs for him. For anybody that I doubt literally anybody watching this channel is interested in fishing in any way, shape, or form. But um, I go fishing with him quite often, and I have really grown to love going fishing with him. So, um... I know he wanted these a while back, um, and it's really funny because he called me and he said, I, I had gotten these, we went, we went, we came through Bass Pro, um, we, I found these, I said, I want to get them so that, you know, I, I'll, I'll, like, I know I have them, I don't have to worry about finding them later, coming back and shopping, because we knew we wanted to come back and shop, and so, I bought these and these, and I, we went down the strip, and, uh, we came back and I called him and I said, was there anything you were wanting specifically from Bass Pro? And he said, yeah. He said, see if there's any uh, Guggen Squad Bandito Bugs. And I said, okay. Um, I said, <laughs> he said, white Bandito Bugs. And I said, no, when I had them in my purse already because I had already bought them. And I said, okay, I'll go look. And I gave it a minute, gave it a minute. And I, I mean, I went over there, right? And I said, no, I don't see any, babe. And... It, I thought it was quite funny, but I'll, <laughs> and he's gonna, he still doesn't know, I'm, I'm, I wanted to wait and surprise him, because I knew that he would be excited, um, but the next thing I got were these Saucy, sw Guggen Squad Saucy Swimmer things, um, so, yes, I, I'm excited to give him these, because I believe he was looking for these a while back, too, um, and I know he uses these, so, I'm very, very excited about those two finds. Um, I also forgot that we went in this little, uh, Lake Life resort wear store, um, and I found this really cute magnet, and usually I don't really like stuff like that this much, stuff like this that much, but this was actually so cute, and it said Kaylee on it, and so I thought, let me get it, you know, this is so cute. So, that's that, um, back to Bass Pro. I got us matching shirts, which I was so excited for. Um, they are Columbia shirts. So, I know he really likes these shirts while he's fishing. So, they're just navy blue, and they just say Columbia PFG down the side. And then I got both of us one matching ones. So, yes, put those up there. And then... I got him this shirt and it just says Bass Pro on it. I thought this shirt was so, so cute and I like it. So I think you will like that. And lastly, I got him this redhead shirt uh, with the buttons on it. So I thought this was actually really cute. I really like this color and um, you know, he has different things that he really likes to wear shirts like that, too. So, I was glad I could get that for him. Um, I also got... <laughs> it's a little cheesy, but I saw these keychains, the blingy, you know, super blingy keychains. And I thought those were so cute. Tried to find my name, could not find it. I was a little bit disappointed. And then I saw this one, and I thought that that was so cute and a little bit cheesy. And... So I messaged uh, my boyfriend and I sent him a picture of it and I said, what do you think about it? And he said, I love it. So I got it or my mom got it for me. Um, and I think it's so cute. So I was excited about that find actually. So um, as I said, we went to uh, the strip and Sight and Sound on Friday. So this is what we got from Sight and Sound. Um, I got this, and it is a Discovering God in Everyday Moments devotional journal. So, it's so, so cute. I like how it doesn't have dates on it. Like, you just kind of do one, I I feel like, whenever you want to, which is really, really nice. Um, like you can see, and it's got, like, little places to write down here. And it's just super small, which is really, really great when you're busy. And I feel like I'll be super busy in college, so I was very excited to find that. Next, we have a whole plethora of shirts here. My mom got this shirt for my boyfriend, and it just says, Going fishing. Of course, he really likes fishing, as you can tell. 
Um, so I thought that was so cute. And then I actually got the same one for me going fishing. And then we both just got Jesus shirts. Oh my goodness, I can't balance everything. Me and mom got Jesus shirts. So, yes, I was so excited about that because I really like to get Sight and Sounds shirt. Saturday, we went to the strip again. Um, so, I already showed you all of that. So, that night we went to Dixie Stampede. So, here is the bag from Dixie Stampede. And, of course, you eat. Um, it's dinner and a show. So, they serve this really, really, really good uh, creamy soup. And I didn't know that I would like it. I'm not a huge fan on soup. But, they sold this in the gift shop after. And I literally thought it was so, 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 so cute. Or, so, so good. So, we decided to get this and try to make it on our own literally all you do is you put this in water you boil it and you add like chopped vegetables to it that's it so i'm very very excited to try this and then they also serve chicken there so they had the chicken rub out in the gift shop so it was only 5.99 and that was only 8.99 which i really don't think is bad because that makes like a whole big thing of it um, so I was super excited about these, um, because the food there was so good. The very, very last thing I got from Dixie Stampede was this. And again, I don't really like many things with like my name on it and stuff, but this is literally like the cutest thing ever. So I was so, so excited to find this. I'm actually going to put it on my keys right now. Um, so yes, that is... I believe everything I got from Branson I'm going to end this video now I feel like it is probably long enough I got a lot of stuff but I was so excited about it um I'm so happy this trip was so fun it was such a good experience it was so great to spend the time with my parents so I'm really glad here we go here we go again trying hard but you want to be my friend in a place to I